So today I'm going to be demoing the Razer Hydra 6 Degrees of Freedom Motion Controller. So as you can see, as I rotate my hand, the cube on screen uh, also rotates. Now, I can move um, in all different directions, and it, um, it still picks it up. See, I'm rolling, I got the pitch, and the yaw. And yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty smooth. And it also can move in six degrees of freedom. So I also have position tracking. So I can move uh, left and right, up, down, toward the screen and away. And it all picks that all up. I could do it to, you know, at the same time and twist and turn and move. And yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty good. So there's a slight amount of jitter um, if you see on the screen. If I move the cube a little closer, it'll be a little more obvious. So you can see there is some jitter. But it's very low, especially for a consumer device. This is, you know, this is great. This is really good. And, um, and I'm not doing any sort of like filtering or smoothing. This is the, the raw input um, straight from the uh, str raw output straight from the uh, controller. And um, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty smooth. And this, uh, this demo right here, this is using the Ogre open source 3D engine and the uh, Hydra, the Razer Hydra Six Sense SDK, and the SDK is really, really easy to work with. I put this together in like a day or two. It was uh, very simple to use. If you're a professional game developer or you have a team of team of developers, this would be you know really simple to add. You know, to add it to a game, it might take a couple of days. You know, real quick. So. Um, I definitely recommend if you're a developer, a game developer, to take a look at this. You know, pick up the Hydra. It's really cheap. It's $140. It comes with Portal 2. So the controller itself is only worth about 100 bucks, And that's really unprecedented for a, for a tracker um, with this amount of accuracy. They claim it has accuracy to one millimeter of position and one degree of rotation. And... It's probably true. I mean, it's you can see in the video. It's pretty. It's pretty smooth. It's pretty accurate. Um, and there's not, you know, really much drift at all. There's very little jitter. Um, it's absolute, you know, absolute positioning tracking, and it's it's really good. It's really good. So I definitely think um, developers should check this out. Um, you could download the SDK for free on Steam. Just search for uh, Six Sense. You'll uh, you'll find it. It's uh, it's free. You can check it out. It's real easy, real easy to use. Um, and if you're a gamer, um, you could see you know how accurate this controller is. It's uh, you know pretty much blows away the Wii or uh, other controllers that have come before it. So um, especially for Portal Two, the control is very nice. It's real smooth. Um, adds a lot to the game. And um, you know, I think uh, people should check this out. It's, uh, it's a pretty cool controller. So, yeah, so, so that's about it. Um, that's the gist of it. You can see, um, see in the video how smooth the, the tracking is. And it's, uh, it's a good controller. Well worth their money.